Alright, hello everyone! Welcome to today's stream. I'm not sure anyone's actually here yet, but I'm gonna pretend with my imaginary friends. Uh, is the webcam really not gonna... No, okay, that's... that's fine. Okay. Um, the webcam is a bitch. Uh, it's good quality and everything, but the little clip thing they use to actually hold it onto the laptop... No, it's terrible. <laughs> My lighting solution is worse, though. Um, uh, is anyone actually... Yeah, no, I don't want to unpin from taskbar. Oh, my God. <laughs> Windows 10, why? <laughs> Fuck Windows 10. Creativity update, yeah. How about an update that doesn't annoy me? How about that? <laughs> All right, it doesn't seem like anyone's here. Uh, let me get my window sorted. Okay, Doc. Um, yeah, so today we're going to be playing Max, The Curse of Brotherhood. And, um, I've, I, I don't, I only know that this has mixed reviews. I, um, have never played it. I got it on eBay for $2 or less. Uh, it was a download code only. Technically speaking, uh, eBay does not allow you to sell only a download code. You can sell, like, a card that you mail to someone with a download code on it, but you can't just sell a code that you email them or something. Technically. People still do it. Uh, I bought it, and I lucked out. You know, some of them could be scamming you, certainly. But, uh, no, that guy was legit. He gave it to me for $2. He emailed me within, like, five hours of purchasing it. And, uh, obviously it was legit. You can also buy this game on Steam, apparently. Uh, it's on Steam, it's on Xbox One, it's also on, of course, we're playing on the Xbox 360. Um, yeah. Is the sound? Let me just check the sound. Oh, wow, you don't have a slider for that. You just have sound effects and music. You are left to the developer's devices as to whether or not they actually balance their audio. Although I don't expect it to be an issue. But it's possible. Alright, let's do, let's do a new game. Let's do it. Let's, let's pee in each other's butt. I wish I was that cool of a kid. My hair gets like that actually when I uh <laughs> don't don't cut it. Oh no. My little brother is having fun with toys. Oh you what he is breaking his car. I wish I had a little brother. <laughs> but I got stuck with a shitty older sister. Wish granted. <laughs> Crying. <laughs> no! It's funny that they named the uh, little kid Phoenix, the little brother. Because Phoenix is Get Reborn, right? So the brother is, like, going through, like, a character arc where he, like, gets taken away and then he's reborn as, like, a better brother. Or a little brother. Same as the older brother, in a way. Like, you know, they're both going through that character arc of becoming better. Because of this experience where one tried to kill another. <laughs> this game's kind of fucked up when you think about it, because I've seen the trailer and everything. And they've got, like, lava, rushing... It's kind of like Limbo, in a way. It's more colorful, of course, but, like, in a way. Like, it's cartoonish violence, but it's still kind of fucked up when you think about it. That's how I wake up in the morning. I wake up, go to the edge of my bed, and just scream. <laughs> So the game begins. Can I go left? No? Nothing over there? I thought there would be like a secret there. Meh, help me! I'm being taken by a giant rock thing! Help me!
Uh, the controls are a little floaty. A little bit floaty. But it actually is... It's like a slightly floatier version of Limbo. Can I not climb that? Can I not climb the rope? Okay. <laughs> uh... I can't climb the rope. I can't climb the rope, that's the thing. There we go, now I can climb it. That was, that was awkward. I was jumping all over that rope. Yeah. R rope climbing is, is not very good, <laughs> apparently. I mean, the controls are fine, they're just floaty. And the rope grabbing is a little weird, obviously. I can squeeze through. That's what she said. She didn't say that. <laughs> I save you, even though I cursed you. Don't you feel like a bad older brother? The game looks very nice, by the way. <laughs> Guess that isn't obvious. This is just the 360 version. I wonder how what the difference is between the Xbox One and such. Or the Steam version. Yeah, he just broke his spine, honestly. He just shook him like that, he just broke his spine. That's a vulture. That's a spooky. Okay, hi. I'm so angry that the brother I wished away is now being tortured. <laughs> Roar. Yeah, you don't have a big rock, do you? <laughs> that was cute. Oh my god, see, that's what I'm talking about. Like, that's like... Oh, chase sequence already? Jeez, we just started. And I fucked up already. <laughs> the rope grabbing is weird. If you press A... Like, he'll grab onto the rope automatically, but if you press A, like, he lets go of the rope. See, like, I didn't press any buttons, and he grabbed the rope. It was a very weird rope grabbing system. Everybody run away! Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go! Run away from the- hello! Jesus Christ. Ha! Ah, okay, my head should totally have been, like, blown off at that point. Oh, climb that shit, climb that shit. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god. This game doesn't fuck around. <laughs> it does not fuck around. Like, fuck you, player. Get the fuck off my level. Can do. Jesus Christ. Them physics, though. Yeah, they don't give you much leeway. You have, like, you know, maybe five seconds of leeway. Yeah, you can't get me now, silly monster. You didn't think that one through, did you? That was, a that was one hell of an opening. Ah, my jaw. They're, like, swollen and shit. I just hope this flare-up ends at some point. I mean, it's gotten better, but it's still you know, annoying. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, 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 and dead. I should have reacted to that quicker. There we go. Woohoo! Woohoo! Okay. Yeah, this game doesn't give you much uh leeway. On reacting to things like that boss chase thing I had like five seconds leeway like I could make five seconds worth of mistakes before the game would kill me <laughs> or even less might have been four seconds which is very very little Jesus <laughs> I have a feeling I'm gonna die a lot in this game <laughs> oh wait I should probably be swinging yeah 
it's like a fluid rope system, but it's like I'm used to more tactile controls of of a rope. And this game doesn't have tactile control on the rope. It just sort of has like looseness to it. That zoom out was nice. That's a nice zoom out. Is that a mirage? But that's a mirage. I'm sorry, did I not see any poppin' when it zoomed back in? That's crazy. <laughs> I don't think I saw any poppin'. Hey. Who's doing what? Who's drawing things out of the sky? It's probably God. <laughs> God himself has come to help you, young Max. <laughs> but you shall become God soon. Whoa. Yeah, because the one of the, the main thing of this game is that you get to draw. In the level. Various little things like the air and the vines and everything. So that's like the whole dick of the game. I mean, so far I'm enjoying it. It's very nice. Pretty nice. I'm all wet. <laughs> I like being wet. Uh. Was I supposed to like swing up and down? Can I swing up and down on that? Can I? No. Oh, okay, I was just supposed to do that and then jump. Okay. Cutscene. Cutscene. Trombone. Is that a trombone or a tuba? Who the hell are you? My, that's my face exactly. Are you ruling the world with him? Or are you, like, having sex with him? Or, like, because this is... What's the difference at this point? Mustachio is a pedophile. <laughs> Before he absorbs Phoenix. He is a pedophile. <laughs> absorb. I enjoy absorbing, absorbing little children. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, that'll do. Let's just a log bar. <laughs> what? Chapter one, three. Sea of sand. Uh, the game's pacing is very nice. It's just kind of like let's go, let's go, let's go. <laughs> I like that. I can appreciate that. I kind of wish it was a little slower, honestly. Like, give me, give me some room to breathe, game. So far, it's been like chase sequence after like deadly pits of death. And it landed perfectly in that hole. That's awkward. My magic marker contains the soul of an old woman. Mm. <laughs> Touch my soul, Max. Touch it. Oh, yeah. Uh, uh, feel it. Feel that soul. Yes. On you go, Max. Phoenix is waiting. That was so awkward. How did they come up with that idea? So our main character takes the soul of an old lady. All right. Wee. Oh. There you go. So you can, I can draw pillars now, and also erase them. 
I heard this was a lot like Trine in that way. And uh, I can see the similarity, although Trine was probably a little more focused on puzzle stuff. This is more of a platformer. Arise! Okay, there we go. <laughs> go on. The town is not far. From there, you can enter Mustachio's lab. No, 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 I don't want to go to Mustachio's lab. He's gonna absorb. Destroy it if you can. What the fu- Ew, why would you just grab that? Finish. Finished? No, 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 no! Oh, there's 75 of those things I can destroy, apparently? Oh, guy. <laughs> actually, this actually does not remind me of Trine, because Trine, you could basically draw wherever you wanted. Ah, uh, this one, you can only seemingly draw where they tell you to. At least at the moment. Jesus. That's where I'm like, it's like Limbo with all these terrible deaths. How do I get up there? Because there's two of those... Yeah, I can probably draw a string in a moment. Yeah, that's probably what they're going to have me do. Yeah, hold on. Erase that. Oh. Wait, what? <laughs> I can't erase it? Like, I can't continue drawing it? There we go. Now... There we go. Yeah, but I need the I need the uh, string. I need the string move. I don't have the string move yet. I'm assuming I get that in like two seconds. Is like that's the only way I'm gonna get those plants. I don't think I can kill that. I think I'm just supposed to avoid touching it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I think I'm just supposed to avoid touching that. Slip and slide. Oh, okay. The game just loves having all these platforms just crumble beneath your feet. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey. Well, how do I go down? How do I go straight down? I guess I can't. Okay. <laughs> okay. Ah. Uh. Ah. Okay. Push and pull. It's like limbo. It's like limbo meets trine. Honestly, that's really what it is right now. Minus, you know, the atmosphere of limbo. And the puzzle elements of trying. It's mostly a platformer. Well, that's nice. Good. I know what I gotta do. Ha ha! I have did it. I have did it. <laughs> I have done it. And now I am safe. From the demons. But not the demons in my heart. No, the demons in my soul are uh, still there. Still tormenting me. No, don't sink me into the sands of hell! Do they have to do a cutscene every time? Yeah, it's weird. They like have to do like a little cutscene every time for that. Mm. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Mm. You come here. Come hither. Come hither. Here you go. Oh. Get on my level. <laughs> Go the other way. Come on. You know how this works. 
Oh. What? Can I not move it down a little bit? Can you go? Can you go that way? Can you go? Over there? I can't go over there. Okay. Well, this is awkward. Uh. It's a little bit awkward. Alright, hold on. I got, I got, alright. There you go. Now it's stuck there. There we go. Whoa, 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 game. Don't glitch on me. Come on. We just started the game. You can, you can be programmed a little better than that. A little bit better. A little bit faster. A little bit harder. A little bit more firm. They even have an achievement for just getting started. Okay. Ironic, considering we almost had a glitch there. Ay, 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 ay. Turn around. Whoa, whoa, ow! Okay, well, I didn't know it would do that. I, all it's done before is lunge at me. Never actually, like, exploded. And I slipped off. Floaty controls make... I mean, at least they put me right there, so it's not that big of a deal. Floaty controls. Floaty walking and running. Floaty penises everywhere. Looks like Squidward. It looks like Squidward's head. There we go. Pull it! Mm. He's practicing for when he's older. Yeah, see, why does the bush have to exist? Because I can't see the enemy very nicely with that bush there. Okay. Oh, I see. We're going to have to make it a step ladder. Guts Gambino! has started watching, and Clarel has just came. What's up, baby? Can you take me higher? Can you fuck me harder? How you doing, mate? I'm doing pretty good, actually. I got a response from an employer. Actually, I don't know if I can reach that. Okay, I definitely can't reach that one. A little bit higher. I just need to uh, send them a example of my InDesign work. And they might hire me. It's 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 weird cuz um, most employers they just ignore you. They don't respond. <laughs> so, it's weird when an employer actually gets back to you. <laughs> What's up, Pimp Punchar, my nigga? What's up? Haven't seen you in ages. But I remember we had some scuffling going on between you and Boz Dogen. Don't worry, Boz Dogen's gone. As far as I'm concerned, Boz Dogen is gone. He's like, no, Clarel, you use a face cam now. I can't like you anymore. Okay. <laughs> All right, I guess you never liked me in the first place then. Oh, no, he showed his face. I don't like him now. Like, <laughs> that doesn't make any sense to me. Rise, gray demons. <gasps> Don't be such a pussy, Max. Uh, camera? I... Oh. Oh! I thought that was, like, quicksand. That I couldn't come down here at all, but okay. I was apparently mistaken. I, I can totally touch this sand. But I'm glad to see you, uh, back, Punchar. I have not seen you, I think, in... Two months? Has it been two months? At least two months, right? Gotta be at least two months. I remember things. I remember everything. Uh... What? <laughs> okay, something tells me that that's actually gonna crawl. 
or not. Oh, it got stuck. Uh. <laughs> uh. Well. <laughs> Not wizard material, is he? You are better looking than I imagined. What what kind of statement is that? I imagined you as a guy with long hair. I can't do long hair. It just it just this just becomes a bush. It becomes like Max's hair in the game. It come it looks honestly like that when I grow it out. Not even kidding. It looks exactly like that. Okay, so I should just move this up. Is it gonna get stuck? There we go. Now it goes. Go get eaten. Go get eaten. Not wizard material, is he? Like, what is, like, wizards can't look good? There's, there's like, several fizz wi wizards. Fit wizards. Oh, now it's a platform. Oh, okay. That's neat. I mean, I don't really use Wiz Channel anymore, so. It's whatever. Can I jump on that? Is that, like, a bouncy pad? No, it's not a bouncy pad. Okay. You should be slaying ass. I should be slaying ass? I don't have any desire to slay. What's so hard about this? I can't look good. So, I mean, I consider myself like a 6 out of 10. <laughs> Maybe a 7 on like a good day. Like if I really buff myself up here. I, I don't mean muscular. I do, I do have some musculature. But, alright, what am I supposed to do? I think he gets his ass slayed. I would make a terrible twink. I would make a terrible twink because uh, I am not, if I was going to have sex with a guy, I would not be on bottom. That's for sure. I'd be on top. <laughs> That's for sure. Now what? There you go. Oh, oh, I see. I have to, uh. I got you. I got you. There we go. On top of the dick, yeah. <laughs> no, I am not a, uh, you know, I'm not, I don't care about sex. So, I don't, I don't know why that's hard to believe because I look good apparently. I mean, I appreciate the compliment. Again, I think I'm like a 6 out of 10, honestly. I'm not, I don't have that masculine of a face. My book. Uh, oh, right, we could just, yeah. <laughs> I'm making it overly complicated. I'm also distracted because I'm also now paying attention to chat, which I wasn't doing for the past, like, 30 minutes. Now I have to because people are here. Stop putting pressure on me. <laughs> yeah, just run across that thin-ass beam. That's the safe, safest way to travel across that. Just run across it. <laughs> Yeah, no, I have no interest in, uh, sex or anything. And I am a virgin. I, I don't care. <laughs> it's 2017. Being a virgin is, at this point, the cool thing. <laughs> at this point, it's the cool thing to do. Honestly. Can I get over there? Yeah, okay. Nope, okay. That is a wall. <laughs> I couldn't tell if that was a wall or just a shadow or... Okay. So this can be pushed but I can't push it that way now. How old am I? I'm 24, but I feel 50. <laughs> Mentally. Not physically. Physically, I feel 24. Um, I'm not as flexible as I used to be, <laughs> but um, I feel like 50. Mentally. Like, I'm, I'm done with the world. <laughs> um, what do I use this box for? I don't even... Oh, okay. I know what I use this box for. Yeah. I know what I use this box for. I got you. I got you, game. I got this puzzle. I got it. I got it. Push that there. Okay, now. You. Come on down. Me go safe. I gotta go be safe. Gotta go be safe. Okay. And pop. Hold up. Wait for it. Wait for it. Arise, great demon. And become one with the ceiling thing. Go, go be the ceiling thing. That's right. Yeah. That's right. 
Nom. Nice. Nice. That's disgusting, Max. How dare you? Max gets off to this kind of shit. A pervert. Does it move back? Does it go back this way? Because I kind of need that. Or not. I guess I don't need that. Okay. I don't know why I made it a thing. Wait, I can go up? Oh yeah, I can go up there now. Is there a bonus thing over there? Is that what it is? Yeah, there's like a thing. There's like a thing. I gotta get some work done, so I'll probably be back soon. That's fine. As I spit all over the place. <laughs> you can get 3D easier than I can, but I don't want to, Punchar. Punchar, like, we, so we had this discussion plenty of times, Punchar. I have no interest in discussing dating or sex or anything. I have no interest in that. So, if you want to go feel bad about not getting pussy, that's your problem. I don't, I don't want to hear it, bro. Saying. <laughs> We've had this discussion many times, and I'm not having it anymore. <laughs> I don't care. It's a wet fucking hole. whoop de doo I got plenty of those. Um, da da dum da da dum I pull it out. I pull it out. I rip it apart. <laughs> what are you looking at? <laughs> Can you take me high? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna come save you, Phoenix. Oh! Physics. <laughs> physics tries to kill me, the game. This is what, that's what this game is. It's physics tries to kill me. Okay, we gotta smash this thing with that rock, I'm presuming. I'm presuming that's what we have to do. Ooh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I see what they want me to do. Yeah, now what? What, what do you mean, now what, Max? It's pretty clear what we have to do. Nerdy gamer girls are the chicks you can get. I don't want them. They're easy. I don't care. The 3D that are my type are Mexican chicks who require a lot of game to pull. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I've, like, of all the things I could talk about on stream... Uh, women are, are not something I ever plan to want to ever talk about. Ever. <laughs> Can you break me apart? <laughs> Everything's gonna get destroyed. I, the problem is, with this game, is it does this breaking stuff so much that it doesn't become exciting. You know? Because... Oh, well, that was cheap. <laughs> um, it doesn't become exciting because, like, everything in this game breaks apart. So it's not exciting at all. It's pretty, uh... Benign. And the game makes it that way just because everything breaks. So it's not that great. Like... It's just that everything breaks. So there's no... Oh. 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 Okay, well, that was that was actually new. That was new. Where do I live? I'm not telling you where I live. I live in America. Go ahead and narrow it down from there. <laughs> what does it matter where I live? Oh, cutscene time? Cutscene time. This game is like kitty, but at the same time it's disgusting. I'm not telling you what coast I live on. <laughs> He's even got like that pedo stash, kinda. How long does it take to absorb Phoenix? He wants to absorb 
Phoenix, which is that little boy. And it's like, how long does that take? <laughs> like, you already have the, he already has them, but how long does it take to absorb a thing? If, if he does it that often, it shouldn't take that long. You know, this game is like six hours. <laughs> so it's like, apparently it takes six hours to absorb Phoenix. Well, I could have told you that was going to happen, Max. Everything breaks in this game, obviously. The town is a bitch. Smile Town. Okay. That font is terrible <laughs> for that sign. Oh. Okay. It's like a reverse bridge puzzle. Oh. Oh, that's as high as that goes. Oh, okay. I thought I, I was being... Again, I'm making it more overly complicated than what it actually was. Okay. I always do that with puzzles. I always make them way more complicated than they are. Oh, so he's gonna chase me? Okay. Chase time! Roar! Uh-oh, indeed. That was it? Okay. Why does everything in this game have to break? So that's my problem, is like, everything breaks, and so it's not exciting when something breaks. Did you just throw a freaking bomb at me? Okay, I don't know how I didn't die. <laughs> I don't know how I didn't die there. Okay. And I missed that. Oh, whoa! Oh, what? Pff, he can break the ground? What? That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, he can break the ground, because that that's fair. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is what I was supposed to do in the first place. There you go. Whoop. You can't get me, I'm the gingerbread max. Who live? She said this was a town. She didn't say it was a ghost town. Who lives in this town? Okay. Does that guy not know I'm here yet? I don't think he knows I'm here yet. He doesn't care that the ground just got raised. Okay. Um. Hey. Hey, you. Yeah, wake up. There you go. Break that. There you go. Come on over. Come on over. There you go. Okay. See you later. Gotta delay him with that. Get on up here. Get on up here. That way. I gotta get the thingy. I gotta get that thingy. I must collect with- I already missed like five of these things, but whatever. I squeeze them when I can. Like a melon. Or a penis. I squeeze penis. Like a lemon. Lemon, melon, penis. That all rhymes. <laughs> and I fell down. Oh wait, I can crawl in there. Hold on. Hello. What was that? What would that do for me? What would finding the broken amulet do? Because it's an optional thing, so what could it possibly do? Protect the town from the forest. But Mustachio already clearly destroyed this town. Who lives in this town that needs protecting? Nobody lives in this town. Okay. What should, I do? what should I do when I'm in love with you? Um. Okay. Yeah, that's as tall as that goes, and that's as tall as that goes. 
It's a great question. What the hell should I do? <laughs> Okay. Um. What do I do? Mm, I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea what to do. No idea what to do. Can I pull that wooden box or something? Can I pull that? I think I can pull this, right? There we go. Okay, I need this to be up there. That's fine. Can I grab that now? There we go. I did it. I did it. I did it. Hooray. I mean, this game is so far okay. It's not uh, terribly special. I mean, I wasn't expecting it to be, but... Um, huh. I can't grab that rope, though. Yeah, I can't grab that. <laughs> oh! Oh! I know what I have to do. I know what I have to do. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I know what I have to do. Kind of. <laughs> I need to make it flipped up. There we go. Okay. Now. Alright, I need to get to the other side of it. Uh. <laughs> I know, I ended up on the wrong side. Okay, no, take me over it. There we go. There we go. I figured it out. Arise! Arise! Can I climb that? All right, hold on. Please fall properly. Thank you. Okay, don't build it that high. I can still climb it. And then just make it the highest thing. There we go. I got it. The puzzles in this game are always like something you see. Like, what to do, and it's just a matter of doing it. So, that kind of, like, there's no stumping so far. So far, there's been a decent assortment of puzzles, but nothing that actually stumps you, which is kind of a problem. I mean, so far, to sum up this game, it'd be okay. It'd be okay. Everything works. But the design is kind of meh. My weapon will gain new penises. Oh. Well, ow! My spine just totally broke. <laughs> you can hear them. <laughs> uh, I used to be a camp counselor. You know? I used to be in charge of kids, and here I am laughing at, like, a little boy just getting his fucking back broken. Alright, come on. You gotta grab that rope. There we go. Okay. Bam. Bam. Okay. We do this. Nope. <laughs> you could have grabbed that ledge, I think. I think you could have grabbed that ledge. I think you could have. If you tried. Max just wanted to commit suicide. I don't blame him. You know. I mean, this world is terrible. Have you Have you seen this world? Terrible. I wouldn't want to live here. And... Mm, trial and error jumping, my favorite. I love it. It's the best game design. You know, when I make my games, I think, man, how much guesswork can I make the player do? Third time's the charm. There we go.
was this published by Microsoft or like was this strictly like a pure indie development? Because I know like some indie studio made this, I think. I just don't know if they had a publisher that was not indie. I mean, it probably wasn't Microsoft publishing because they only released it. They did release it on Steam, but otherwise I don't think it's on PS4. Maybe Sony just didn't want it, I don't know. I feel like Donkey Kong. <laughs> At least they changed the environment, though. Went from a desert to a forest. I think we could be a little more imaginative considering I have a magic marker with an old lady's soul in it. You would think I could have a little more interesting environments, but okay. We got the forest level, we got the desert level, we have an old lady in your marker. Her soul is in it. I'm just saying, you, I think you could be a little more creative than forest level, desert level. Welcome to the forest. You are close to the first holy place. On our holy place. Is God there? Oh, jeez. Okay. Now, I remember seeing that from the trailer. So I, I already knew that that was going to happen. I mean, again, everything breaks in this game, so it's not exciting when anything does break. These traps That's one of the problems with this game. It's just everything... Oh, really? Come on, I wasn't even close to him. <laughs> See, everything breaks, so it's not, like, exciting when anything does, because they do the whole breaking thing way too much. Game, that's when a, that's like an example of a game ruining itself. It just does its surprise thing so many times that it's no longer a surprise. <laughs> I totally should have died. Oh no, it's like... Oh, was I supposed to run back after that? Okay. Alright, game. I was gonna make a joke of like, Oh no, I just run forward and everything's fine, but alright. The game, the game did, uh, invert that trope there. Of rowing forward and you don't get any damage done to you. I mean, the game doesn't really have a damage system. It's more like die or live. It's just a binary yes, no. Which isn't a problem. I'm just saying. The problem with dying in a game is that once you die, it takes away all the tension. So, like, in Limbo, there's actually not that many ways to die. And all of them are rather gruesome, and the game actually sits there and paces the death a little bit, and makes it impactful. Whereas this game, you die and you go right back to the checkpoint, and there's no real sense of weight to it. And I get the reason why, is because Limbo is a very, like, dark game, so to speak. So it's got this little boy, and you, like, chop him up and everything, and it's, it's a silhouette, so you can get away with that. Whereas this game, like, they have an anatomically, you know... They have an anatomical boy here, not just a silhouette. So they didn't want to be as, like, gruesome with it. Oh. I thought I was going to grab that rope, but okay. Um, they don't want to be, like, as grotesque with it. And I get that. But Limbo made its deaths way more impactful than this game. Especially when they're still killing him in gruesome ways, but they're not actually showing you it. It's just weird. You know? Because it's like, Limbo did it better. But I get why they're not being as grotesque, but mm, still not, like, beneficial. I don't know if I was necessarily clear in everything I just rambled on about. Whee! This is it, Max. I get my power to make vines now. I never played this game before, but I already know, like, <laughs> what, what it is I'm going to get. Whee! Yeah, I'm going to get to draw the vines. Yeah, I know. I get it. Just give me the power, game. Just give me it. Just give me it. Go down. Go on. Yeah, it must be the way out, so. Can you take me lower? Can you fuck me anally? I wouldn't recommend it. My asshole is quite hairy. So. Wouldn't recommend it. 
the information I share on stream. I won't tell you where I live, but I'll tell you all about my asshole. <laughs> And there we go. Why are you guys spinning your hands? It's gross, Max. It's gross. Yeah. Gross. I think punch our left. I don't understand. I think punch our left. I don't know if you left punch our. It's like it's like punch our shows up though. And it's like if I don't talk about women, he leaves. It's like I don't want to talk about women. <laughs> I have other things in life to uh care about. Oh, you can actually, like, draw stairs with the vines. That's interesting. Yeah, then erase it. Go ahead and do that. Oh, that's, that's, okay. That's unique. I need a longer one. There we go. I need, I need a less limp vine. A less limp one. It's just weird. Like, I go on Twitch so I can chat with uh, streamers about women. It's like, what? <laughs> Some of us don't care <laughs> about women. So, sorry. <laughs> Not interested. It's just weird because I haven't seen I haven't seen Punchar in two months, and the first time he shows up, it's like, hey, you want to talk about vagina? I'm like, no. <laughs> no, I don't want to talk about vagina. Way better things to talk about. <laughs> what? There we go. A little finicky to draw these vines. Uh, I mean, this one could be way longer, right? There we go. They, they, they are very phallic vines. Let's be honest now. They are very phallic. Okay, hold on. There we go. And now push it. Is that, like, tall enough? <laughs> what? Okay. Is that tall enough to get me up there? There we go. Yeah. yeah. You tell him, Max. Is that like a bonus thing here? No? Is this the way I'm supposed to go? Uh... Okay. <gasps> You just drop it right on him. It's so awkward. I'm such a dick. Push and pull. Yeah, the thing is, this doesn't get very long. There we go. Okay. Oh, come on. You can climb it, but you can't stay on it? There you go. Okay. Like, I need this one to not be this low, though. Like, this... It looks like a penis coming out of the wall. <laughs> Hold on. Really? Draw this one. <laughs> oh, 
this is uh, this is awkward. <laughs> um, yeah, I need to like redo this. I need that one to not be so limp. I need them all to not be limp. So limp. All right, hold on. That's also wrong. Yeah, Max, accept your failure. There you go. The thing is... Alright, I, I need a second one. Yeah, you know what I need? I need a second one. I need a second one. But I need it to be... Landing on top of it? The problem? <laughs> Needed to land on top of this one. Okay. Like, you wanna work with me, game? Work with me? No? I don't think the game wants to work with me. There you go. Get up there. That's... That works. This is working. Okay, well, it was working. <laughs> it's just like I'm playing with penises, honestly. Oh, wow. Okay, there we go. I made it. Wow, okay. <laughs> that was really awkward. That was a very awkward puzzle. Can I grab that? I s Here's the thing. If I fail to grab it, then I'm going to be very pissed. So it's like... Thank you. <laughs> um, where am I supposed to go? Oh, I see. This is entirely a bonus puzzle. I see. This is like entirely a bonus puzzle. Yeah. All right. Hold on. You got to get. Why do they get so limp when they're done being drawn? There we go. Got it. That was entirely a bonus nice thing. Job, Two out of 18. What happens when I get all of her rune things? Does it, like, do something useful? Because I can't imagine it increases my, like, well that I have to access from. Because that would seem like something that the game should give me as, like, a story progression thing. Not as, like, a bonus thing. I don't know what actually I unlock by doing that. Slice, dice, grow. <laughs> I totally, like, I'm going to fall after this, though. <laughs> that's, uh... That's intentional game design, right? <laughs> that's... That was, that was supposed to happen, right? Did it save it? Did it at least save it that I, gra I still grabbed it? Yeah. Okay, well, that's awkward. <laughs> yeah, that's awkward uh, design right there. All they had to do was make it able to be grown longer. That would have not happened. Okay. They're just so phallic. It's not just me, right? Like, other people think that this is a penis, right? Like, that's just a penis. It's just it's just straight up a penis. Is there a bonus thing over here that I'm missing? No? Okay. It just looks like a penis. It looks like a green penis. Nothing wrong with that. I'm just, I'm just saying. And it also, like, moves like a... I think it's because it moves like a penis. That's why. What kind of penises do you see that move like that? I mean, limp ones, you know? Like, that is a- like, look at that. That is a limp-ass penis. <laughs> Alright, that is too limp of a penis. Can't climb that. It's too limp. That's the thing. You also have to account for it being, like, 
limpy like that? Weird. Okay, do I need... You know what I need? Okay. Can this one be drawn long? No, those two are short. Because what I wanted to do is make, like, a thing to prop one up. But okay. I guess I'm making it too complicated again. See, that looks like a penis. <laughs> it's not just me. It totally looks like a penis. But it doesn't, like... It, it doesn't... It doesn't make it... Like, it's like you have to find the right level. I think that works. There we go. You have to make it really... Snaky. Get up there! You can climb up there! There we go. <laughs> Don't bullshit me, Max. You wanna save your brother or not? Okay. Good. Damn, this dumb. My thumbstick is really beaten up. Like, really concave compared to my... One thumbstick is very concave than the other one. It's weird. Was that you humming, Max? Or was that somebody else? Yeah, I just crawl in the dirt and make groaning noise, too. Can I, like... Am I supposed to push him? I don't know if- I don't think I'm supposed to push him into that. I think I was supposed to get rid of him. Yeah, I think I was supposed to get rid of him in the first place. Let's try that again. I think I was supposed to get rid of him. Yeah, I was supposed to do that. That'll give me more time. You just got a stall. There you go. See? Told you so. Yeah, you're a cool guy, Max. You're so slick. Yeah, good thing he doesn't. He doesn't see me. Good thing he doesn't uh, see me. Good. Ah, uh, can I grab that? There we go. Good. Oh, there was actually a thing I could have to, to, to get between them, but okay. I beat the game. <laughs> At its own logic. I didn't need your extra puzzle help. Ow. Oh, he's throwing bombs at me. Stop throwing bombs at me. It's rude. Wait, I can use his own bombs against them. Watch. There we go. I blew him up. You guys, are you guys are really stupid. What? I didn't die. Wow, game. I didn't even die. Oh, but you fell off the vine. Yeah, but it took control away from me. That's why I fell off the vine. Basically was saying, oh, you fell too much. You want to try that again, buddy? Oh, my. God. It worked the other time. Now it's not going to work. Oh, now it works. You guys, are you guys are really stupid. Shut up, Max. You're the one who got us into this mess in the first place by banishing your brother. Okay. Up and out. Oh no, it's the run times. Are you gonna hide? He can clearly smell you. I can smell the little boys, but I can't grab them. I can't see them. <laughs> Clearly, that sounds wrong. I know. What should I do? What should I do when I'm in love with you? Shouldn't I just like 
that and then cut it. I need to make it like a bridge. I know what I have to do. I can just make the bridge big. Maybe if I draw it like a hula hoop. Draw it like a hula hoop. Oh. Oh. Huh. Huh. Okay. Huh. That's like the first time this game's actually surprised me. Look at that. It's funny that they had to tell the player, though, to draw it like a hula hoop, because the, they would have probably never figured it out. They probably did the playtesting, and they were like, people never figured it out. I don't think I need to do- do I need- I don't think I need to do the hula hoop for that. Yeah, I don't think- yeah, I don't need to do the hula hoop for that. Uh-oh. Okay. What? She already punched me? What baloney? Oh, he walks, he walks away now? Alright, wait, should I wait for him to walk? I guess I gotta wait for him to walk back. Hell, man. There you go. There you go. I got it. <laughs> I did it. I did it. I did it. Hooray. Only I could fucking climb things. There we go. <laughs> you know why the controls probably feel floaty? It's because they're using like a similar control scheme to Limbo, but Limbo was 2D. This is 3D. And so things are like a little weird in my book. Okay, I have an idea. And then... You lift it up. Okay, that's not exactly what I had in mind. Okay. I can fall down though, right? Nope. I thought that was like a ledge. Because it looks like a ledge, but it's not. What to do here? What to do? Oh, that goes way high. Okay, hold on. That's as high as it goes with the thing, though. Weird. Can I can I land on that? See, the problem with this game is it's a lot of trial and error for these things. It's a lot of trial and error. There you go. Okay. Another piece, Another piece for me. me. Okay, this brings me back up there. I'm assuming I can't solve the puzzle unless I'm up here. Okay. So... Was that was I supposed to do that? Okay. Oh wow, that was bar that barely made it. Okay. Come on. Okay. It's not that I'm, like, bored. It's just that there's not much to say. Please reconnect controller. Really, Xbox? Really? The 360 has terrible wireless connection. I'm 
pointing right at the console. Like, it's a, if, if this controller is not always pointing at the 360, it will lose connection with the console. And I don't, I don't think it's this controller. I think, the th honestly, the 360 just has shitty fucking wireless connection. The PS3, for example, I could be upstairs, and that PS3 controller, if I, heard, if I hit it on, the PS3 will turn on all the way down here. Right, that's great wireless. This fucking thing will only turn on the 360 if I'm pointing at the fucking 360. Ridiculous. <laughs> Okay. Glad that happened. Huh. Oh, okay. I can I can walk just under it. There we go. I don't know. The game is so average. It's just so average. It's the problem with this. It's just... It doesn't do anything wrong, but it doesn't really do anything spectacular. You know? And I'm not, I'm not really sure if I could even say that. Like, again, it doesn't... It, it's really not bad at all. It's just... It doesn't do anything, like, terribly interesting. I don't know. Yeah, I see what I gotta do. There we go. I don't know. I, I feel like it has elements to be interesting. It's just not interesting. That's the problem with it. Okay. Well, obviously I'm not supposed to go that way. Yeah, I can't crawl in there. Okay. All right. This is just a bonus thing, I guess. I like how you jump, press Y to pull it down. Okay, I mean, that makes sense, but still. Very awkward. Okay. There we go. All right, cut it. Get to the other side. I mean, one of the biggest issues with this game is just that the puzzles are never, uh, are never stumping. They're never, they never stump you. Come get me. Wait for it. Have a nice party in there, boys. The only thing left to do is fuck each other anally. That's all you got. Roar! Get us out of here! Roar! Like, that's cute, but... Mm. <laughs> it feels like they had ideas for this game, but they just didn't, like... Build them up. Or at least make them different from other games. Because, <laughs> again, it's a lot like Trine meets Limbo, but it doesn't have the atmosphere of Limbo. It doesn't have the weight of dying that Limbo has. It doesn't have the creepiness of things that Limbo has. And it's like trying, but it doesn't have the puzzling mechanics of trying. It's it's like the two had sex, but they didn't actually make a baby. It's it's like they had a stillborn fetus. Basically what it is. You are headed towards You are headed towards he not easily cry, but once you reach his heart, your weapon will be even more, powerful. more powerful. I mean, the game's not very long, so I don't know if I'm like it's only like supposed to be like six hours, supposedly. 
But I don't know if I'm gonna have, like, the will to play this the whole day. Because <laughs> it's not, it's not boring, it's not bad, it's just benign. Okay. Is this where I get my vine stringy thing? Stringy move? Can you take me higher? What? Are those? What are those? Those are vines? Vines? Yeah. You've been, you've been grinding on them before. Ah. You've been climbing on them like the whole game. I mean, those were ropes earlier, but still, I mean, it's the same freaking thing, honestly. I missed. <laughs> uh, Max and the curse of the physics. Physics is a curse, honestly. Because physics and gravity... Absolute bastards. Every time I drop something, right? That's gravity's fault. <laughs> nice. Dude. Again, it's like they, they have, like, the stuff of trying to kill him with, like, all these different things. And that's kind of, like, reminding me of Limbo. But it's not dark like Limbo because it doesn't actually show you the deaths. And that makes it not as impactful. And it doesn't have the puzzling of Trine. It's not enough of, like, a stumper or interesting puzzle mechanics compared to Trine. So, it's again, it's like Limbo and Trine had a baby, and it was Max, and it's just so in between both of those games that it's just not good. It's derivative. Which doesn't make it bad, it just makes it unmemorable. Like, if this came out, and there wasn't Trine, and there wasn't Limbo, maybe this would be, like, good. Right, because it would be the only thing we had. It would still be, like, weird, because, again, it's... I don't know if I'm explaining this properly, but it's, like... You have all these gruesome deaths, but you don't show them because it's, like... A kid. Like, an anatomically correct kid, so you don't want to, like, kill a kid in a game. Because that's still, like, a stigma to it. But, like, Limbo killed the kid, but he was a silhouette, so he wasn't, like, anatomically correct. But... Max and the Curse of the Brotherhood ha finds itself in this very weird limbo of like gruesome but charming, childish but adult, and it's just, just don't they don't rub very well. <laughs> they don't rub very well at all. Okay, do I just go down? I think I just go down. You have to do that every time? Every time? Weird. I don't know. Father Oak. Well, this is a lot less interesting than the, uh... Than the previous stuff. Why do you want me to cut that? I need that. Why would I cut that? I don't want to cut it. I need this. Why? Why is the game telling me to cut that when I need it? Yeah, they were like, oh, you can cut it. It's like, okay, but why would I do that? I need it. This is a lot less interesting than even the uh, vines you can make before, like the stem things. I can do what now? Oh. Okay. 
Okay, that is that is actually pretty interesting. There you go. That's that's actually the first thing I can say. Oh, that's not derivative of something else. <laughs> At least not to my knowledge. But when you spell out the pu like the game holds your hand too much. It doesn't hold your body. <laughs> It's like, yeah, it tells you what to do, and it's like, yeah, game, you just taught me how to do it. I don't need... I don't need the, uh, memo. No, I just cut it too short. That was why I couldn't grab it. Yes! Whoops. <laughs> I don't give you much leeway on that one. Really? Was I supposed to make this like... Hold on. <laughs> I think I was supposed to make that a different one, but hold on, this is a bonus one? I think this is a bonus. Can't grab it from over there, really? Yeah, there, there we go. I may, I might play this for just another 20 minutes and we might switch to something else cuz I don't know if I'm going to honestly continue this game. <laughs> cuz uh It's not bad, it's just so benign. It's like, yeah, I mean, it's serviceable. But it's also annoying. It does shit like that. Uh, cut. Woo like, it just doesn't do anything well enough to really be memorable. See? <laughs> it, it, like, it's so trial and error with that shit, and it's really annoying. Okay, hold on. It needs to be swinging the other way. There we go. It's still annoying to, to manage that. But none of this is, like, fun. It's, it's like, things to do, but it's not fun things to do. It's just sort of like, yeah, these are mechanics. But none of them are that engaging. That's the problem. Oops. This first. Whoa. No, you don't got it. <laughs> Got it. Dead. Ah, <laughs> uh, what? I jumped. <laughs> I jumped. The the floaty controls are not great for this stuff. Okay. It's weird how he screams like that, and it like it plays the sound effect of him screaming to his death, but he never actually dies because you didn't die. So it's like the game preemptively thinks you're gonna die, but you're not. Really, Max? Come on. There you go. There's only, like, one user review of this game on Metacritic, and it basically just says that, exactly what I've been saying, that 
It doesn't do anything wrong, but it's just, it's mediocre. It's just average. It's, it doesn't really pickle anything. Oh, you can combine those two as well? Uh, okay. <laughs> Now what? Like, he says that, like, as if the puzzle is stumping you, but it's not stumping you. Not like, like, now what? Like, if you could only say that if the puzzle was actually stumping me. The puzzle's not stumping me. More or less trial and error a lot of the time, which is not great puzzle design. Puzzles should not be trial and error, they should just be, how do I solve it? <laughs> and this is gonna be another, like, chase section. I think this is gonna be, an yep. Yep. Called it. Hey look, all the puzzle elements went away. It's probably gonna be a chase segment. So you could call- it's- it's like the the- It's like the half-body walls in, like, Gears of War. You can tell when they're just gonna be there. <laughs> that there's gonna be a fight. The game uses these chase sections far too much for them to be entertaining. And I thought the game was gonna slow down. See, that's- that's another problem. The game does the slowdown thing, where sometimes you get a time to actually, like, do something and it slows down. Like Prince of Persia stuff. But you don't control that. So I thought the game was gonna have a slowdown there, but it didn't have a slowdown there. Which isn't that good <laughs> to, to do that. Like, it's a guessing game as to when the game's actually gonna let me have a slowdown and not. Really? How cheap. I also have less of a connection with Max than I did, like, the Limbo character. That's another problem. They gave Max, like, visuals? And I can't grab that unless it's swinging, but if it's swinging, then I have to wait a few seconds to be able to grab it. So you turn it into a trial and error thing, and then it loses all adrenaline that it possibly had, but it doesn't have any adrenaline because I've already been chased by this creature several times at this point. And I've been chased by other things at different times and everything breaks. It's like they made the physics of the game, and then they were like, man, let's just make the whole thing about these physics working. And that's not good. Right, should I make it swing the other way so I don't have to wait a second? I think that's what I have to do. But it's not fun and it's not engaging. You you could see on my face, it's not like this was ever engaging. It's, it's like, oh, this again. You know, that's the feeling I have. Like, oh, we're being chased again. Oh, things are breaking again. Oh, I have to do another trial and error puzzle again. Oh. <laughs> like, none of it's interesting. That's the thing. Because none of it's actually interesting. Roar! Oh no, it's... I'm holding forward. What? What? You have to start all the way over? I have to start all the way over. It's not like I could do anything different. I just ran forward. That's all you could do at that point in time. At that point in the game, you can only run forward. You couldn't do anything else. So how the hell did I not run forward well enough for you, game? I mean, I can only hold the thumbstick straight during that little section. And he ate me. I was holding the thumbstick straight the whole time. Max is way more concerned about this than I am. I'm just frustrated at this point. Annoyed, really. Not even frustrated, just annoyed. Which is lesser than frustration. Yeah, it's like, okay, he yells me again. That's like 
what they're trying to do there is they're trying to like reset the distance between you and him when they not when they knock you down. They try to reset the distance between you and him, but like I said, I was holding forward the other time, and he still ate me. It just didn't make any sense. See? There's nothing else I can do. I can only hold forward. I can't do anything else. So when you punish me for doing the only thing I can do, which is hold forward, because I wasn't like... Like, I, I don't even know what I'm doing wrong. You can only hold forward. It's really weird and awkward and not very well designed. See, look, I can only hold forward. I can only hold forward. I can't do anything else. And you die. Am I like, like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I'm just supposed to hold forward. I don't understand. Is anyone even here? Where did that Ruinot's not here? Nope, no one's here. Because I want, I want, I wish someone was here to like share that with me. And how stupid that is. Because you, you can only go forward. <sighs> I'll do it one more time, but I don't know what the game wants from me. You can only hold forward, and and then at the last moment that you actually like reach safety. He eats you and I, I can only go forward I can't do anything else I can only go forward game I can do nothing else but go forward he like double jumped at one point and there's no double jump in the game but he double jumped he double jumps but there's no double jump in the game I don't think they play tested these chase sections well enough and or they don't give you enough leeway because it's as if you don't do if you don't do it perfectly he will eventually catch up to you at some point in the chase sequence because he's scripted to be in certain areas at certain times and that's not the best way to script a chase sequence i would know i've done straight i've i've made chase sequences in my games and they are not this ridiculous at all see how much further ahead i was now I think I think I was a little bit further ahead. Let me see if I was further ahead. See? I was just that little bit further ahead, and now I got to the point that I could actually make it alive. So unless you do it perfectly without any physics fucking up or anything like that and jumping off at that log, because if you don't jump off the log, then you won't be far enough, you get eaten. That's really bad fucking design. All right, it shouldn't be that fucking precise. <sighs> really? Am I supposed to make, like, the wheels or something? I think I'm supposed to make them wheels. There you go. That was a terrible chase sequence, though. That was awful. It was so precise in terms of what you were supposed to do. And the game's physics often didn't work for it. It just often didn't work. The game definitely misses out on the execution. <laughs> I just feel like they didn't playtest it enough or they didn't refine it enough. Or make anything terribly, like, interesting. <laughs> 
because it's, it's a lot of derivative stuff. Like I get, like I said, you're combining limbo with trine and making this, and it doesn't work because it's like the adult and the kitty and the fantasy and the realistic, and it's like you can't. <laughs> it doesn't fit. It just doesn't fit. I think I'm done with this for now. <laughs> I think I'm done with this for now. Like, I don't think I'm going to continue it. It's not that engaging. It's not... I can't really make commentary on it. Because there's not much to talk about. <sighs> Do I have anything else downloaded that's, like... Worth or shit? No. Okay. Um, you know what? I guess we can... Is anyone here? To like... Help me decide or something on what we want to do. Because I don't want, I don't want to play Max anymore. Like ruin out on Steam or something. <laughs> and just not here. Because <sighs> I think we might just go right into Skylanders today then. Because Alpha Protocol I've played so much. So I don't even know if I'm going to necessarily stream it anymore. Honestly. But it's so much. <laughs> My a Why does Microsoft insist that my email shows up in the top right there? For the record, that email is like the email I had as a kid. Because I got this thing at, when I was 13 years old. So that email is like throwaway. Like I don't, I don't use it anymore. So, <laughs> Plus my business email is public anyway. Yeah, no one. But there he's snoozing and Flamis isn't here. Okay. No one's here. All right, well, because I was going to ask if any viewers were here, like, what they wanted to do in terms of doing Skylanders, I guess. I mean, I'm, I'd be happy to do Skylanders. So, but it wasn't supposed to be today. And I don't want to do Skylanders unless, like, people were aware that I was doing Skylanders. But, um, I don't want to end the stream just yet. Like, I'm, I'm going to change the video and everything. And I'll find something else to stream, I guess. And if we do Skylanders, we do Skylanders. I was hoping Max to last longer than two hours. And honestly, it I, I would have ended it. If I wasn't streaming, I would have probably stopped playing it after an hour. <laughs> Let alone that chase section. That was terrible. But um, thanks anyone for watching now. Thanks anyone for watching in the past. Somehow. <laughs> or the future. Somehow. Through magic. And the internet. Um, but, uh, I will be back shortly. I'll probably, I'll post on Twitch again when I'm going actually live. It might be, like, ten minutes or something. Because I hate to, like, because I still have three hours of stream time left. So. I will be back, though. Don't, don't buy Max for two dollars. Just don't. Buy Limbo for two dollars. I know, it looks like I, the lighting still needs adjustment, and I have the shittiest lighting situation. <laughs> uh...